six pack and Aki Sven said come in at number 10 with their Kentucky fraternity victory where he was most impressive taking both his elimination and then the final in 49 and one. Coming in at number nine might be one of the most impressive Little Brown Jug comebacks ever as Courtly Choice made a break in his elimination, then came roaring back to win the final, giving driver David Miller his fourth Little Brown Jug. The Swedish invader Crusado Della Nelce comes in at number eight as he shocked the world winning the $1 million international trot for Brian Sears and young training star Marcus Melander at 30 to one. Number seven features Sharton, who did something no other has done in a season before. With victories in the TVG, Breeders' Crown, and many other stakes throughout the year, she has become the first mayor to reach $1 million in a single season. Homicide Hunter, the son of Mr. Cantab, put up a grinding and game effort at Lexington to become the fastest trotter ever for owner Crawford Farms. He takes the number six spot on the countdown. Coming in at number five is driver Matt Kakali and his comeback to racing. Following an accident at Yonkers, he never thought he would drive again, but he did and came back to win the Adios and his first Breeders' Crown. Up next is McWicked. He has had a big year and is up for Horse of the Year, banking over 1.5 million. His effort at Lexington in world record fashion in 46 and two lands him in the four spot for 2018. Number three is the three-time North America Dash champion Aaron Merriman, who became the first driver in harness racing history to have two 1,000-win years. He accomplished the feat at his home track, Northfield Park. The second spot goes to the talented Philly Atlanta, who bounced back from being second in her elimination and taking the Hamiltonian final in 50-4, and four, becoming the first Philly in 22 years to beat the boys and gave Scotty Zeron his second Hamiltonian win. As if it could be disputed, the great foiled again takes the top spot as he ends his glorious career with almost 110 wins and over 7.6 million in the bank. His connections gave back to the fans by putting him on a farewell tour and trainer Ron Burke earned his sixth straight $20 million season.